Hello, first graders. Mrs. Conley here for your foundations lesson for today. We will be testing our letter sounds and our letter formation and when you are at school this week. And when you're home, we're also gonna be working on tapping, using the sounds that we learned to tap out words. Okay, we're tapping out sounds to make words, okay? And I know you're just gonna fly through this. Okay, so I'm gonna share my screen with you so you can see the words that I'm using. Hope you're all having a fabulous day so far. Okay, so we are gonna make words, okay? And we're gonna make a word. We're gonna say the sound of each letter and then we're gonna blend them together so we know what the word is. Okay, this first one. S. Okay, so I have S, S. I have A, A, and I have D, D. Okay, so let's do those together. You're gonna need your fingers, okay? So we have S, A, D. Put them together, sad. Good one. One more time. S, A, D, sad. Good job. Now, let's try Right, you probably already said this one before we even got all of the letters up there. All right, we have m, a, p, map. All right, how'd you do? M, a, p, map. Remember, that's why we click those, we clip those sounds, right? All right, now I'm gonna change this. Now for this one right here, I have m, a, p, nap. Like, I know during the day I'd like to take a nap. Okay. Now let's make. Now let's make mm, a d. Mm, a d. Mud. How'd you do? Sure, you did fabulous. All right, now let's look at s a t s a t sat. Nice job. Okay, let's try a couple more. <clears throat> let's try s a p. Sap, sap. All right, good job. Sometimes when we do these practices, we might have made up words or nonsense words. And it's just so we can tell the difference. What's a real word? What's a nonsense word? Okay. So for example, if I said, J, A, Ooh, hmm. J -a -g, jag. Not totally a word, right? But we just use those words, those nonsense words, to help us practice our sounds. Okay. Remember, friends, when we look at this, this, this should look like your magnet board that you have at home. Um, we have our pink letters. Do you remember what those are called? The ones that are in the pink? Those are our vowels, right? We have a, a, e, e, i, e, o, a, and u, a. Uh. And they do also have a long sound, but we're going to get to those later, okay? And then we have our consonants. These are all the other letters of the alphabet that are consonants. And vowels are special, remember, because every word we ever say has to have a vowel. It 
always has to have a vowel, otherwise it's just not a word we use. Okay, all right, let's try a couple more. Sip, sip, all right, nice job, nice job. So what I'd like you to do today, friends, is on your magnet board, okay, put some of those words together. Put, I'm sorry, put some of those letters together to make some words. And we call these words CVC letters because they're a consonant, vowel, consonant, right? So if I have B, A, T, right? I have B, A, T, bat. This is the CVC because this is my consonant. This is my vowel. This is another consonant. And that's why I know that this A is always going to say its short name, A, A, Apple, A. Okay, so practice making some of those words with your magnet boards. Try writing them on your dry erase board, practicing that really good handwriting, okay? And then if you're able to, take a picture of what you came up with and put them on Seesaw so your teachers can see all the hard work you're doing while you're home, okay? Okay, friends, thanks for joining me. Can't wait to see you when you come back to school. Have a fabulous day. Stay organized, right? Keep all your materials in one good spot. Make sure at the end of the day that you put all of your stuff together for, the, for school the next day, right? You should have your Chromebook in your homework bag. You should have your supply box, your red folder. All of those should be in that, that homework bag or that big book bag that you have. Okay, and then make sure you have your water bottle, your snack, and whatever you're having for lunch. Okay, guys, have a fabulous day, and I will see you next time.